everyone, I'm Donna Louise, and for the love of puzzles, let's build some lanterns. This is the second puzzle that I do from YWOW Brands. If you haven't seen my other video, I'll leave a link down below. It was the one entitled Macaroons that I built with my friend Wendy. Now it's a thousand pieces. It's a photograph. There's no artist listed. It's from their photographer's collection. And on the back of the box, we see that there was a total of six puzzles in this collection. That's the Macaroons one that Wendy and I built. I chose this one because I just, thought it was beautiful. The lanterns, the colors, the designs, absolutely gorgeous. But now, as I'm going to build it, I'm feeling a little overwhelmed, maybe a little anxious. I have no idea why. I've done bigger puzzles, more complicated puzzles. Puzzles are meant to be fun and enjoyable. Perhaps it's just my current state of mind, but I'm feeling a bit nervous about doing this puzzle. Silly, we'll see how I feel at the end. So I'm gonna take time to sort the pieces off camera, probably do by color, like whites, yellows, reds, whatnot, dark, um, and I'll pull out the border as well. I just need to maybe center myself and focus on the pieces and the imagery, and I'm sure it'll be a lot better then. But also, what I do love, they include a poster, so you'll see me have this in frame while I'm building the puzzle. It's much easier to work with the poster than with the box. I love, love when they include a poster. So nice. So, for the love of puzzles, let's get to building.
and another puzzle done. To tell you the truth, I'm glad I took those 40 some odd minutes to separate out the pieces. Did it mostly by color, whites, yellows, reds, blues, green, darkers, and I put the border aside and I did that later on. I'm really enjoying doing the border after I have quite a bit of the center puzzle already assembled. I think it's a lot easier. So that's something new and different about me. Now, when I did this other puzzle by YWOW Brands with Wendy, I don't remember the pieces being sticky or finicky to work with. However, this puzzle, they were quite a bit. Um, a bit annoying at times, but not that terrible because I was holding the poster in one hand and basically only puzzling with one, my other hand. Whereas if I put the poster down and used two hands, maybe it wouldn't have been so noticeable that the pieces stuck together. That being said, it was an inexpensive puzzle. I think I spent, what, eight New Zealand dollars on it. So really, for that price, it's a beautiful puzzle. Seriously. The imagery is beautiful, the colors are beautiful, and it was a lot of fun to do. I don't know why I kind of felt overwhelmed or anxious to do it at the start. That was just kind of a weird feeling. Maybe it was just all the design and, I don't know, maybe the lanterns all being cramped together. I don't know. Do you ever get like emotions or feelings attached to a certain puzzle like excitement or joy or <gasps> you know I don't know how to explain it but I felt almost a little <gasps> not panic that's too much that's too hard of a word but I just felt a little a little anxious about doing it maybe I felt like I wouldn't succeed I don't know why why did I have that feeling oh well it's past the puzzle was fun to do. I enjoyed it. And I want to thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. For the love of puzzles, I hope you enjoy my videos. Please consider subscribing. And until next time, ciao!